It's been 355 days since the first wrestler craze. Why that sticks out on my mind? I don't know. Jesse Jones losing the internet championship? Well, that was a pretty memorable day. Gaza Coleman versus Steve Carino? That was memorable too. But it boils down to one thing. The motivation in the back of my mind that tells me that was the day that Jesse Jones humiliated me and fired me. I sat there ready to be in his corner, help him be alien, something he'd never done before. But no, he tossed me to the curb. Look what happened. Elian kicked his ass four times, took the title from him, and pretty much the internet championship was never to be seen in your world again, Jesse. But you know what? I didn't take that for granted. I sat back, I waited for my opportunity, I became the head PWA official. I sat back, I did commentary, waiting for my shot, waiting until I got my spot on the roster, or I could come after you and get my revenge and prove to you that after three years together, I was not your lackey, I was your equal. Now, I had a few stabs at it, but all of it was tag team action. Let's go back to December. It was you and, La you and Lack against me and Prodigy. It came th I came that close, but you guys got Prodigy, and, uh, and an opportunity was lost. We had a several other promotions, whether it was Eddie, Danny Magnum, you take your pick. I couldn't get the job done. Not with a partner, not with three partners, I just couldn't get it done. Then a new opportunity came. Jake O'Reilly stepped into my life, said, you know what, you're up and coming, you're promising, you got right hair, what the hell. Let's be Irish, let's be the Irelanders. We gave it a step, we went up the tag team titles, but mutual interest aside, we kind of lost touch and lost, goal of, lost the goal of what we were going after in the first place, the tag team championship. So there I was, stranded, wearing green tights and pretending I'm a freaking drunk. Well, that is not precise Paul Wright. That's not even Paul Wright. I'm just a simple guy, and I need to have a little bit of retribution in my life. So, people wonder why they throw 100 bucks out of the PWA management to fight Jesse at WrestleCrise, knowing he's going to probably be the busiest guy out there, considering he's got Ruffy, the Flatliners, and Elian, all the cheat for and all the backstab for him. But, Jesse, I figure you can make a little open time on your card to face me. Last year, you, hum you humiliated me. This year, it's your turn for humiliation, Jesse. At WrestleCraze 2, Paul Wright, Jesse Jones, mentor versus student, whatever you want to call it, I'm coming to kick your ass, and I'm coming for retribution. I'm coming to show you that I'm your equal.